Inside the pages of this true crime novel titled When Greed Turns Deadly is a story of a gruesome murder in the Gem State. It's a story Victor Rodriguez knows well because he brought the killer to justice. And soon the story will be on the silver screen. Out of all the homicides I've done, this one was the most telling as far as, oh boy, just going and going and going and trying to figure out different loopholes. On July 24th, 1989, Rita Ronda and Betty Gray were gunned down inside this home outside of Idaho Falls. Victor says this crime was all about deception. Inside, police found signs of a satanic ritual killing, but Victor knew the chilling scene was just a smokescreen. Turns out, Betty's husband, William, killed them over infidelity and insurance money. At the crime scene, within four hours, we had already figured out who the suspect was. And, uh, however, it took almost four years to bring that case to uh, to the criminal court. It wouldn't be until William Gray's own children filed a wrongful death suit against their dad that police were able to get a conviction. Gray died in prison in 2010. 28 years have passed since Rodriguez was dispatched to the scene, but soon he'll tell the story for a Discovery Channel crime documentary. He says he's doing it all to not only let the world know, but so the victim's families can find more closure. I thought my law enforcement career was over. That's what I wanted to retire from, but but they still keep popping up, and, and, and I, I'm, I guess I'm just honored. Michael Severin, six on your side.